this is Ryan Ellis, and I'm joined here with the legendary Lee Kennedy. We are driving down the Detroit Riverwalk, and you can't see it, but Lee and I can see a freighter going down the river, and I'm hoping it's not going to dump any illegal species into the water that will uh, wreck our habitats, our ecology. How are you doing today, sir? Ryan, thank you, Ryan. How are you doing? Oh, the wind is is my friend today. Oh, it feels good out here, doesn't it? Oh, man, it does. Couldn't ask for more, pretty much. So, uh, you had three record players at your store, two inside and one outside. Uh, uh, one with 45s and two to play albums. Well, yeah, to play whatever we had to play. You know, yeah, album, we could play anything, you know, that's for use. Yeah, yeah. And uh, you had multiple workers, therefore you could keep up multiple record players. And uh, Florence, she wanted the music turned down low whenever you came around. Or I'm sorry, whenever she came around. And so you'd have to turn down the music for her. Is that right? Well, not necessarily. I'm just saying people, when they think, People didn't like loud music, no place. And back and then, was, back yeah. Back then, people in low school, she thought I was being obsessed with what I was doing, that's all. Yeah, yeah. You know, but we're not going to try to school what they should do. Shoulda, coulda, woulda, you know? Exactly. They didn't do it. I did, I did my way, and they didn't. So. Making another cameo. Making another right. cameo. Okay, right. <laughs> There's our friend who he just uh we just uh saw him for the second time today. He was in uh in a video from last week. Yeah. Give a testimony of your greatness. Right. I don't I don't remember his name, yeah. And, and we, we just met another gentleman earlier who uh remember remembers you and remembers your store. So I mean you you are ubiquitous to this day. I mean your store has been closed like what what's it now? Uh twenty two, sixteen, thirty eight years. Your store, your store has been closed longer than it's been open, than it was open, and people still remember you. That's a compliment, Mr. Cannon. Right, right, right. Thank you, thank you for that, you know? I mean, you know, did you think that, you know, your store opened for 25 years, it's been 38 years since it closed. Wh what did you think people would take away from your store, you know, like, you know, memory-wise? You know, uh -huh. they've said what they think, but what do you think, what, what did you think they would say? Uh, hey, I don't know if they, if they want to think, what they think about what they did then, they thought about where they got music from. You know, everybody reminisce what you did in the past. I don't care what you, what, what it is. You know, you be thinking about what you remember the time when you did, you said this and you did that. You met this person, you met that person. That's just part of life where it is. You know. Ah!